YouTube, what's up, man? We're going to get into some great gameplay, but first I want to update you guys on my team, what it's looking like and what I like in the game so far. Patrick Mahomes, best quarterback out. He's definitely the, the one for me. I don't know who else you guys are using. Comment below on who you're using at quarterback. But Mahomes with the 91 throw power. I have go deep cam, so he's 91. I have sprinter, 77 speed. Uh, his accuracies are crazy. Uh, a lot of cams, a lot of everything looking good on Patrick Mahomes. So that's who I choose to be my quarterback. Uh, wide receivers, uh, we're using three. I actually use Saquon Barkley, a running back, but I have Marcus Allen. Marcus Allen, I kind of use it like a pseudo tight end, a uh, wide receiver type position. If you guys want to learn how to do that, check out MaddenTurf.com. Or you guys can sub to my Twitch channel. The link is below for my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash dub dot. And join the sub-only streams on Wednesdays. I'll show you how to use Marcus Allen at the tight end position in cluster. But then I'll use Odell, Marvin Harrison with Slot Apprentice to do the hot routes. And Tyreek Hill with the 91 speed. I don't have Julio Jones. I have him. I should sell him, honestly. And my Tory Holt, once I hit level 50, I'm not at level 50 yet. Once I'm at level 50, he will probably play. Offensive line, I think I have uh, the best pass blocking one I can have uh, right now. Because you guys know I pass a lot. My tight ends, I don't use them. Defensively, I'm in a 3-4 primarily. Another thing you can get on MaddenTurf.com, the 3-4 odd defense that I've been running early in the year that's been devastating people and you will see in this upcoming video how devastating it can be got Ken Houston I use um Ken Houston Ramsey Patrick Peterson and Mel Blunt those are my four DBs now if I go to dollar or anything I have Derwin I have Eric Berry Slay I have OB and uh, Tavares Moore Apke you know the, the, the cheap cap guys that are the cheap guys that are fast just in case I want to go to dollar three through five but my two outside linebackers um, I've been throwing around Von Miller, Khalil Mack. I have them. Uh, middle linebacker, Shazier Wagner. I've been flirting with using Anthony Barr a little bit with that new sub superstar edition, Anthony Barr. Um, but right now, Wagner, Shazier, Von Miller, Khalil Mack, my three down linemen, Michael Strahan, Geno Atkins, and Aaron Donald. Now, Strahan, for me, hasn't done anything. That's because he's in that 3 4 defense. Uh, not really in a spot to go get after the quarterback, but he, you know. It is what it is, but like I said, my four DBs, Pat Pete, Mel Blunt, Ken Houston, and Jalen Ramsey. People telling me to get that Gilmore, uh, I'm, I don't know who's going to replace you guys. No, I love Pat Pete, love Ramsey, love Ken Houston, and love Mel Blunt. So let's see how this team does against Problem, the best man player of all time. So we're kicking off against Problem, man. This was the second time I played Problem all year. If you guys watch Problem play, you can do that at you know, twitch.tv slash problem, right? Most of you guys probably already know that. Uh, and if you want to watch me play, twitch.tv slash dub dot. This is uh, obviously playing problem, kicking the ball off first. No, he is a run first type player. He is a, you know, defensive player. So if you, you can stop him from scoring, get some points, get the lead. It's always going to help you. I'm going to come out the first play, and we're going to try to just establish the physicality. And Marcus Allen does that for him. Breaks two tackles, uh, pretty much computer, but he runs out of bounds. Doesn't want to take a hit. Playing smart there. But we're going to go ahead and up the pressure. Next play, he sends out everybody. Instant set. We see Anthony Barr. I got him at outside linebacker this game with Von Miller. Barr getting to the quarterback again. When they come free, that 81 speed, Anthony Barr is pretty fast. Here, he max protects and able to hit this corner route to Marvin Harrison. Getting in the field goal range. He's going to go for it on fourth down. Right here, listen, I'm bringing everybody in the box. If he max protect, I want to take Mel Blunt. And sometimes you really have to send the missiles. And when I mean send the missiles, we're going to go ahead and come off this edge. If he blocks the running back, I'm coming off the edge screaming. And that's what we do right here. Bang. And I get to him before he can throw the ball to my man, which was the tight end. That's the Mel Blunt. 80, 88 speed, I believe, making a big play there. Dump it off to Tyreek Hill. Going to take that angle on Gilmore. Get out of there. Run through the tackles. Try to stay in bounds. Actually take a big hit from Mel Blunt himself right there. But big play, first play from uh, Tyreek Hill. There's Beckham actually getting bagged by that Gilmore I just talked about. Just locked up Odell Beckham. He's going to a little bit of man coverage here. We use Odell Beckham's speed to get away from Gilmore right there. Take a hit out of bounds from Deion Jones. Get to a third and six. We're going to throw this post route over the middle. Marvin Harrison, that slot apprentice, should be able to put him on the post is big. That's why I have him in the slot, making that play right there. Uh, and we get first and goal. We're going to hand it off. Marcus Allen. Dang, he makes the play in the backfield. Get to a second down. He's running a little man covers. We're going to step up in the pocket and find Marvin Harrison again. Manned up on Mel Blunt. Just kills him. That was a smart routed out route I put. So I put a post route and a smart routed out route. And he chose to cover the post. And I hit the smart routed out route. 
Marvin Harrison is going to beat man covers nine times out of ten. Best wide receiver in the game right now. So if you guys don't have Marvin Harrison, make sure you get that done. First and ten, like I said, stop the run. That's what Aaron Donald does. When you're playing problem, you have to stop the run. We're going to go up here and get physical again. Second and ten, we send everybody. Von Miller gets the quarterback before he can get the ball. He's not blocking anybody. If you're not going to block anybody, next play, he blocks the whole team. He dumps it off to Keenan Allen. Aaron Donald peels back, makes the play. See, if he blocks enough people, he'll have some time. But if you choose not to block anybody, it's going to be a long day. And it's been a long day for Mel Blunt trying to guard Marvin Harrison on the post route over the middle. We're getting into the second quarter. Try to take a two-possession lead would be huge right here. Look for a bomb. I don't have it. Try to dump it off here to Marcus Allen. But Ryan Shazier is just all over that. Makes a play. Second and ten. Throw the little whip route. Yeah, he covered the delay route, but the whip route, one of the best routes for man coverage this year. Give you a separation, probably about shoot, 10 yards of separation. Throw the hitch route over to Tyreek Hill. Holds on to the ball. Gets the first down. I'm 8 for 9. 99 yards and a touchdown. Step up in the pocket, but his three-man rush really got at me right there. John Randall. I didn't even know there was a John Randall card yet, but he has this John Randall. Makes a play. Mahomes mobility moving up. I talked about that 77 speed. Putting Sprinter on the quarterback. Just that extra bit of speed will definitely come into play later in this drive as I hit a post route on third and eight. Ken Houston a little bit too slow. More Marvin Harrison. That's what I've been killing him with. Ken Houston just kills Saquon Barkley right there. Trying to use some clock here. Get this to the, you know, under the, or the last possession and a half as I see Mahomes. See a big valley. I'm playing on conservative and I get to the end zone. Doesn't get hit right there. Gets into the end zone. Patrick Mahomes, 77 speed, is fast right now in Mutt, especially for a quarterback. That's a huge play. So it's 14-0. Uh, last drive at a half. Hopefully I don't give up a touchdown. I'm okay with giving up three. I get the ball at half. Uh, and his first run, he really just gets outside. Just trying to make sure he doesn't score a touchdown. Let him spin. Tackle him in bounds. Keep that clock running, man. I'm okay with giving up three. Next run, Bobby Wagner makes the play. Uh, that's why I use him. I, he pisses me off because he's slow, but he definitely makes plays from time to time. And Pat Pete killing that bubble screen. Time's ticking for him. He throws a little out route right here. Gets the fourth down. I'm going to call him a, call a timeout. Force him to kick three. So that, that nice little run got him three. And I'm, I'm fine with giving up that three points because I get the ball at half. Hopefully I can score a touchdown. And if I can't, you know, uh, we're going to... We're still up 14 to 3. This is the end of the half. Just chucking something up, trying to make something happen. Now you just can't give up a touchdown return. Click on your fastest player. Just swarm. We're going to have 14 to 3. I feel great about that. Get the ball, man. If I could score a touchdown, that would end this game without a doubt. Even taking some time off the clock, getting a field goal 17 to 3 would be a big deal. First play, we'll dump it off to Barkley right there. <laughs> Take a hit stick for five yards. That's pretty much what the game is about now. Uh, here we go. I try to hit the corner route. Do it a little bit early in that flat zone. Shazier. I mean, you guys, you guys haven't choose Shazier as your mutt captain. You're really sleeping. Right there, my running back really sold for me. He did not make a play right there. Get to a fourth and ten. We're looking deep for looking deep for Tyreek Hill, but we just get hit. And I believe he got Von Miller on the edge there, coming off the edge, hitting the quarterback and Gilmore making that play. I saw from the snap of the ball right there that I was going to hit go go deep and try to hit the speed of Tyreek Hill. But just wasn't there. So now we just got to hold him to three. Or we can't give up a big play right here. Uh, goes for that that little uh, read ops or RPO again. But Bobby Wagner's all over it. Get him to a fourth and 12. Send everybody. He blocks everybody. But he has nobody to throw to. Ramsey swats it. So we're, I don't think he, ha he has two long runs. Other than that, he hasn't been able to muster anything offensively. Shazier's killing me. Gilmore's killing me. He's playing good defense. That's what problem will always do. Play good defense. Step up in the pocket. He sends the guy manned up. Definitely boxed me right there. Good job sending that man up guy. And we, he gets off the edge again right there with Joey Bosa, I believe. Uh, just throw a little drag to get him field goal range. This is 17. Uh, make it what? Make it 17 to 3. We're up a whole two touchdowns. Uh, plenty of room for error when you're up two touchdowns. So I might play safe on defense. But I've re he really hasn't had an answer for really sending a lot of people at him. And making him uncomfortable in the pocket. He goes to the RPO again. Ramsey gets off the block of Marvin Harrison. That's why I like Ramsey. That's why I like Pat Pete. They get off their blocks. They make plays. Going for the wheel route. Mel Blunt should have been picked off, but is incomplete. Uh, really doing a good job defensively right now. Come off the edge right there. He hits me with a spin move. Uh, Got to just keep Marcus Allen contained pretty much. I'm probably running a couple random plays. I haven't seen him run too much. Um, here's a little wheel route. A bunch of quads, I believe he's coming out in. And this play, I got the middle safety. And I tried to flirt with guarding the post and this wheel route with Ken Houston's speed. I, I got a little too greedy on the post on the post right there. 
give up a huge play to Kittle. That's not what you want to do when you're up two touchdowns. But uh, still up one touchdown. Just need to take some time off the clock here. Hopefully get a field goal in the game. Held RB right there. I'm definitely on conservative at this point in the game. I hope as we get Beckham right there running up the middle, take another huge hit from Ken Houston. I mean, his sticks right now are just outrageous. Have all day right there. Throw the ball underneath to Tyreek Hill. Try to hold RB, but Shazier's fast enough to get to me. Now we're just using some clock. We can get down to four seconds. Once again, little hitch. He's sending so many people. It's, that's what I mean. When you're down seven, it's really hard to play defense, and you have to take a lot of chances. Again, you see him sending six people. Everybody's picked up, able to hit this wheel route over here to old Del, or Tyreek Hill, actually catching that wheel route, that speed. Uh, and that's going to put me up 14 points with two minutes left. That's going to end the game uh, pretty much unless it collapse. And this is really going to end the game when uh, Bobby Wagner puts Tyreek Hill in the dirt. Ball bounces up, and Khalil Mack takes it to the end zone. Take it to the Baja. Well, I'm going to go out here. I uh, get tackled right there. Next play, I'm going to run it in for, for an easy touchdown. That's pretty much going to end the game. Uh, it's always great playing problem. He's a great defensive player, but I got up on him that game, really sent some pressure, and really made him uncomfortable.